Hey guys, so I'll take a very, very quick look at uh, Diablo on the original Game Boy. Now this is a uh, very, very, very early prototype uh, for a uh, portable Diablo and uh, made by Blizzard. So that's, uh, yeah, that's kind of interesting. I couldn't believe it when I actually uh, found out about this game, but uh, yeah, so let's take a look. I've uh, played this a little bit to make sure it works and uh, frankly there's not much in it. So you, uh, the camera zooms in, you see your character, and then you can walk around. So you have uh, full eight directional movement with the Game Boy's D-pad. Uh, the A button uses a sword attack, which uh, you can kind of see there. Uses, uh, I think it uses kind of like the rotoscoping technique, but I don't know. Uh, we have some barrels with what honestly look uh, you know, like mustaches on them to me, but eyes and mustaches, but yeah, anyway. And uh, the B button, unfortunately, does nothing. So, uh, you know, for an original Game Boy title, this is a pretty faithful looking port of uh, Diablo. Now, uh, as you can see, you know, basically I'm just walking over the top of everything right now. It's a very, very early prototype. I'm uh, not sure who leaked this, but I think it was leaked a while ago now. I think 2007 or so. Uh, there are some treasure chests lying around, but I can't interact with them, at least not that I can find. Uh, enter does nothing, uh, select, sorry, uh, you know, start does nothing, uh, select does nothing. Yeah, so there's not a whole lot to do aside from walk around and admire the uh, beautiful original Game Boy graphics. Although with a lot less uh, puke green, of course. So, uh, yeah, there's nothing really much to say about it. It's just a very interesting thing to think that at one point uh, Blizzard were making a Game Boy game. Uh, although, of course, when you think about, say, uh, you know, their ports to Nintendo uh, 64 and whatnot, it's it's not that crazy, but uh, I think it's just kind of funny thinking about Blizzard now, and uh, particularly when you're talking about now a uh, console port for Die Boy 3. But anyway, so it's just a little oddity. Just wanted to, uh, you know, take a look at and uh, talk about. So thanks for watching guys and see you later.